23. Yesterday's 23 is quite substantial. <clears throat> I'm not going to give you uh, the rundown details. You don't need to know that. Apparently, somebody had an interest other than what would be the best interest for the country in mind. Rather, why don't we pay off our kickbacks to our campaign funders for these last couple of years and uh, use a simulation as a way to cover up the evidence? Again, you guys are pretty good at it, but not as good as you think. Number two, version two. Not announced in the United States, by the way. I saw your cocaine deal flip. Are you guys trying to pull a flint? I think you are. My understanding is that right now there is a process whereby there is either a augmentation of existing technology or there is a process by which there will be a recalibration of existing technology. Several years there have been efforts to bring court cases against a medication known as Abilify. My understanding is that Abilify is a medication that augments whatever's going on in other medications. But the allegations are that Abilify uh, ends up excitating certain tendencies to engage in violence, including very significant sexual violence. What's the status of those cases? And why were you bundling on cases regarding Abilify to a mother that was trying to maintain custody of her minor children that were being trafficked for Medicare and pension fraud? Is it because you guys are pulling a flint? Do you have early delivery of bottled water for you specifically while you just sit on for what? How long do you plan to sit on the fact that you're about to get a fucking patch that the DOD had fucking ready last fucking year while the rest of us are supposed to do what? Maintain status quo? When are you going to deploy your beautiful uh, behavioral scientists to try to give us some sort of conflict resolution techniques about how we're not going to riot when we have to get those care packages? Sorry, I'm not uh, comporting myself. Uh, my understanding is that right now there is a uh, effort to distribute some kind of uh, alleged medication that is really a augmentation of existing nanotechnology. I'm not sure if it is a specific kind of nanotechnology that is meant to be injected or ingested into the bodies of members of Congress and the Senate specifically, as if they are some sort of uh, first or priority uh, people. My understanding is this is not part of a test. This is not part of a human test to do it on yourself first before you distribute it to others because this technology was already ready and available in last year's Department of Defense budget. And I actually put a request in to somebody of concern in an official process in order to get implemented a process by which this could be made available to people. Unfortunately, what got engaged instead were options of military assistance from Russia and medical assistance to Africa from China. And meanwhile, domestically, what do we have going on? I believe what we have going on is a flip. Sit on what happened at Flint. See if you can get away with war crimes that were committed locally and then created on a larger scale as part of another kind of satanic ceremonialism. If you don't like the understanding of trying to mix the separation of church and state, including the Church of Lucifer, then I will let you know I'm very disappointed with your trafficking scheme.